Says Alex Carey connects with this one. And it's a stunning catch on the boundary. Cam Bancroft, we've already seen a Macca's Classic from him this season. And that might be another. Yes, unfortunately, Alice Carey has to go there. Hatsol Glue has made him play a false shot. And as you just alluded to there, you said that's the second time we've seen Cameron Bancroft take a cla classic catch. Alex Carey looking to hit this over mid-wicket. Normally we'll put that just in front of square, but he's actually got too much of that. That's an outstanding flying catch there by Cameron Bancroft. Yeah, outstanding catch there by Cameron Bancroft. You talk about big moments. That's one there, one by the Perth Scorchers. Alex Carey departs for one, four for 22. Into out. You know, he can go big, but he goes straight to the fielder. We've seen this so many times from the Grand on this season. He looks to launch, but he finds the man, and the strike is now five down. I actually think the ball was there to hit, just mis-executed. Mis a bit slower and a bit wider. He's thrown it up. He's tried to hit that over cover. And he's caught the outside edge. And it's gone a long way, all the way down to Nick Hobson there. It takes a comfortable catch. And Hats Oglu gets Colin de Grand home. Strikers lose their fifth wicket. That's five for 37. The needs of their life to get back into the game. He goes again, he targets the same area, but of course it is Cam Bancroft positioned at deep mid-wicket and he takes the catch comfortably. Hats of glue, has three. Whenever they tried to move the game forward tonight, it just or today, sorry, just hasn't worked for the strikers. Henry Nielsen again targeting that short side, got a low on the bat. Safe catch there to Cameron Bancroft. And Hats of glue's got three. Just goes bad to worse, doesn't it, for the strikers there. Harry Nielsen has to depart. The strikers are now six for 52.